anniversaries that are um, happening right now for me and for you know, people that uh, I've traveled this life through. And um, uh, one really crazy one is that uh, Live Through This, our album, uh, came out on April 12th, which is going to be in a, you know, a week, and um, exactly when Coachella is, which is uh, <laughs> funny, but, um, and, uh, and also, um, this, this, this is kind of weird stuff that happens that shows you that life is circular and that there is karmic forces at play, and, um, but I mean, this coming Tuesday, it'll be April 8th, and, uh, and we all know April 8th is the day that everybody found out, or, you know, and everybody remembers where they were when they found out the, that news. And uh, um, this coming April 8th, uh, what, 20 years ago on April 8th, I was uh, down in Marina del Rey, and... Um, with Francis and you know and Courtney and um, and we uh, we got the news. My dad was the one that called me and told me I was in a hotel room. And, and so we uh, we flew on a private jet up to uh, Seattle for the circus that began up there and um, and uh, the sad circus, not the fun happy circus. But uh, and the funny part was this uh, this. This coming Tuesday, I'm going to be on a plane with Courtney again, <laughs> which is just bizarre since we were, we hated each other's guts three months ago, and uh, and so we're going to be on a plane on the exact day. And this time, she's flying to New York to induct Kurt and Nirvana, and you know to witness that event uh, into the Hall of Fame. It's going to happen next Thursday, so. I kind of uh, wrote a little piece just this morning just to kind of wrap my head around that because that was um, just, it just, life is just, I mean, it's, it, the universe has to be laughing at us. But uh, <laughs> it's been 20 years since your final painting, a splattering of genius onto a horrific wall of shame. Now, 20 years later, and you're to be inducted into the haunted Hall of Fame. Can't get any more mainstream or dead as all that. Wonder who you'd get to accept your on and in your in your honor. Michael Jackson's gone now too. I'm afraid all the humor left when you did. You said you chose Nirvana because it means freedom from suffering. It also means to extinguish, to blow out like a candle. You tried blowing out your fire with fire but it only became invisible, transformed. It burns, it burns here to this day, along with so much suffering, the heartfelt throb from your unnerving absence, your voice in bits unavoidable. They say that when one cuts one's life short, they have to experience all the pain all at once that they would have experienced had they lived out their natural years on earth. But you know that now. No nirvana to be found in needle, noose, or gun. We must remind ourselves of this when our syndicate of sorrows takes hold. The fact is, the pain you tried to avoid was bestowed upon those you loved and left behind. There are bridges and tunnels built upon this same faulty logic all over the world. Track marks of trains, a suicide forest in Japan, even a hungry volcano waiting for the leaps of forlorn lovers. We all have a cherry tree in our hearts waiting to be watered. Spring comes with a splash, a new chance to bloom or drown. George Washington knew nothing of this when he chopped that cherry tree down. I cannot tell a lie. Nobody alive or dead is safe anymore. There's no place to run. The loop of life drives us mad into the ground. When you break the circle, it bleeds like the ring of fire. It burns an earthquake of hate. Twenty years and nothing much has happened. Nothing and everything. They re-examined your case. No new evidence. Just a few rolls of undeveloped film. The conspiracy movie continues. 
fools trying to carve our legacy into the milky white skin of illusion. Accept another award, more speeches, empty honor for our shooting stars. To have light, one must endure burning, said Viktor Frankl. You're right here with me every night, burning bright in my map of dreams. This is not going to be the most uplifting night. <laughs> I'll try to make it a little bit.